What's up guys, see you guys, King Sing 9 here back with a video exclusively for you guys. I jumbled up my words because I'm excited to have finally hit on the sneakers uh, website here in Malaysia because we don't have a sneakers app. So, um, I'm glad that Nike came up with a promise to always restock the shoe, but we today have a Nike SB, obviously you can tell from the purple box. And this is one of the three constantly restocking colorways of this Nike SB Dunk Low Pro. And it is, wait, read the, read the tongue label first. It's the Dunk Low Pro in the black, white, black colorway, otherwise known as the black gum. So when you first open up the box, you're greeted by this immensely um, fragrant scent of the materials, but before we get into the shoe, um, I wanted to note that you finally get a Nike SB sticker after all these years. You don't have to be a pro rider to get the stickers anymore, so that's pretty nice. Um, but yeah, this is basically the Dunk Low Pro in the black gum colorway. The other two colorways are obviously the, um, the Wolf Grey and the White and Gum. So uh, on the resale market, this is obviously the one that has the lowest um, price, but it is a an exceptionally nice shoe. I will give it that. Um, the first thing that I want to talk about this um, this release is that it is actually a, a retro of the ISO pack or the in-store only orange label pack or basically like the dunk box boxes pack. So this was an orange label exclusive whereby back in the day you could have a, you would have a orange Nike SB label instead of that white Nike SB label on the inside. Um, aside, aside from that, the one thing that does make this shoe or these three colorways or this specific release very, very special is the fact that it says, support your local on the tongue tag just right there. And that is just a shout out to all of the skateboarding shops who've been keeping it real and regardless what the argument or the conversation is about Nike SB not being a core brand, they are in the skateboarding market and they are doing things for skateboarding. If you want to be a responsible skater, just, you know, just, just do your homework and support what you can. But you can't knock the fact that the Nike Dunk is actually an influential skateboard shoe even before Nike skateboarding was ever developed even before Sandy Bokdecker was on the line. There were pros that were in between shoe deals that were rocking dunks exclusively um, and, and just because they could, um, because maybe because of the colorways, maybe because of the materials, but we can actually say that the Dunk Low Pro is actually a skateboarder's shoe nowadays. So. The main reason I bought this shoe obviously is because of the nice materials. You can see the color changing materials all over the triple stitch, so, sorry, the, the double stitch toe cap here. Um, it's it's the same nice little ashy new bug that goes all the way around. And like I said, it does change color. Um, one thing that I want to note about this shoe is that it does not come with spare laces, which kind of suck, but you can kind of tuck your laces in uh, between or behind the little tongue flap just right there, so it kind of shields it away from grip tape abrasion. Um, the swoosh on the on the medial side here, or both sides, is actually a pretty, pretty nice, uh, genuine leather material. You can tell from the cut just over there. It's pretty thickly cut, and it's a pretty nice touch. Break up in materials, basically. Um, on the back, you've got a white Nike uh, symbol. On this side, you have the same thing on this side. The tongue is nice and actually pretty, pretty puffy, uh, much like the, uh, I would say this is pretty close to the old, old SBs, uh, not like the current SBs. Uh, I think the Why So Sads didn't have a tongue as puffy as this, but this is like a special kind of puff right here. On the back, you've got that tongue label, um, black lining for the back of the tongue and on the inside with the little, um, I don't know if you can see that, but you've got the Achilles heel lock and Achilles pillow system just right there going over all the way around the shoe. 
Um, you've got white tips. Uh, you've got Nike SB on the tips just right there. Like I said, I wish this came with spare laces. Um, on the inside, it's just your standard Zoom Air uh, insole with um, the Poron in there in the front. It's just an all black sock liner basically. Uh, you get to the white midsole with a gum outsole which is um, mentally here in Malaysia. For us Malaysians here, gum rubber always uh, withstands our weather, our gravel, our concrete. But um, ever since I was a kid, people that were playing badminton always said look for like gum rubber outsole shoes because they will last you for a long time and probably they were like making references to Tim's and whatnot. But uh, you get a gum rubber outsole with the Vector Tread, the re-engineered Nike SB specific dunk pattern with the re-engineered midsole, having that phylon insert just peeking through for better compression and impact absorption. So that is basically the shoe. This is a real quick go over of a very, very simple, very, very wearable Nike SB, which hopefully you guys will be able to cop soon. Just be patient, please do not pay resale. I know I am knocking on a lot of my friends' businesses, but for this specific shoe, you do not have to go to the resellers. It's not that limited. You just gotta wait just a little bit. Besides, I am pretty sure that um, the re-engineered Nike Dunk uh, for Nike SB Dunk basically is gonna stand the test of time. You just gotta learn to use shoe glue and, and, and just, you know, do whatever you must like super gluing the, the threads basically using shoe glue and whatnot but um, they should last you a pretty decent amount of time until the next drop comes and hopefully um, I hope to be able to cop all three colorways of this specific shoe so that is the Dunk Low Pro from Nike SB this is the black I call this the essentials pack or the premium pack but that is basically the shoe hi I'm your boy TJ got kicks 89 Let's pray for all of the bad juju to go away. Let's hope the conflict ends soon. From the river to the sea, Palestine will be free. TJ Got Kicks 89, I'm checking in, checking out. Peace.